clear that uh, we are determined. We are dedicated, but we are determined to bring about true media freedoms in our country. And we are very clear in our minds that media as a fourth estate needs to operate independently. It must self-regulate. Obviously, it will operate responsibly. We believe no media organization or a member of the media, an individual, will be allowed to be harassed under any circumstances, when our time in office comes, no one. In addition, no media house or individual will be detained, arrested, or media house shut for performing your duties. None whatsoever. That's a commitment from us. We dedicated, we understand the importance of media freedoms. Even in the economic management process, disclosure, for example, on public procurement, tenders, to make sure that when we are in office, any tender, be it for roads, be it for ambulances, be it for fire tenders, will be given to the best bidder in terms of quality, in terms of delivery time frames, in terms of, if you like, price, competitiveness. No wastage of money will arise under the public procurement program in the UPND government. But for that to happen, the eye that will ensure that that is happening is the media. Very important. Very important. And no one un should underrate the importance of this aspect of the media. Because if tenders are given, contracts are given, even without tenders, even without a comparative analysis, that's why we end up having a road that should cost $300 million, is costing $1.2 billion. It means somebody has taken away $900 million which belong to the people of Zambia. In our case, such a thing in partnership with the media will never be allowed to happen. And we want to challenge the media. We, you will be free to watch our steps in the night, in the day, in the contractual processes, the contracting processes, in the way the UPND government will take decisions, economic decisions, 